This is going to be a quick video about how to add a Doppler radar map to to your weather uh, monitor up here on your panel. And uh, the first thing you'll have to do, if you don't have this uh, monitor in your panel, uh, to add it, just right click on your panel and click add to panel. And from here you want to go find weather report and then you just click add and it should add it to your panel. Uh, when you do that, if you right click it and go to preferences, you'll have this window here and from here you can change some uh, some settings, uh, which units you want it to use and uh, things like that. And uh, from here you can pick the location uh, you want it to monitor. And uh, down here you see it has an enable radar map and there is a default one but it's very small and not uh, detailed and uh, what I did uh, as you can see here there's an option to use a custom address for a radar map and that's what I did and to get that map uh, open your browser and go to radar.weather.gov this is for people from the US. If you're not from the US, uh, I'm pretty sure you can find some other website that will have a um, Doppler radar for your area. But just make sure that the map is uh, a GIF file because uh, that's what the the monitor will accept. Okay, so once you're here, go down here and you can pick uh, the area where you are. I'm uh, in Detroit, so I'm gonna pick uh, Great Lakes. And you see right here at the bottom of the map, it says loop of this image. If you click that and just wait a couple seconds, you should see that the map will start moving. Um, and it'll show you the last uh, couple minutes of uh, the Doppler radar. And uh, what, to add this to, to the panel, you can right click it, go to copy image URL, and then you go back to your settings here, and you just paste it here. And like I said, you can from this website you can pick your area. But if you want the whole USA, um, you, you can see up here it says full resolution version of the loop. And if you click that, you should have a map of the whole USA uh, with a loop too. And you can just right click this same way and copy the image URL and paste it here. And that's what I did. And when you do that, now to see it, all you have to do is uh, right up here on your panel, um, you just click the weather monitor and this window will open. And as you can see, it gives you some uh, some details about the weather, like temperature, uh, wind, uh, sun rays, and sunset. And uh, you have a, a couple other tabs here. You have the forecast, so you can look at the forecast here. And then you have radar map. That's the one we just added. And if you click that, you should be able to see the map, and you can move through it. Or if I maximize it here, I can go to the area I want to look at and uh, I can see it from here without having to go to a website or even open the browser. And as you can see this will keep um, updating so it'll be current. Okay, thanks for watching.